Yo guys, what is going on? My name is Gossy Vito and there's 205. Today guys, I am back and today we are doing a top 5 unique tips for YouTube to become successful and be a good YouTuber. So, yeah, um, as you can see there's some Minecraft gameplay in the background and uh, hope, hopefully you enjoyed the parkour. So, my first tip, and it's kind of a big one, it is... Ignore the hate. So this is the first one. Ignore the hate. Be happy that you've got a comment and a view. So when I first started YouTube, um, and in 2012, I used to get really anxious about people saying nasty things. You're fat. You're ugly. You're mean and stuff like that. Now. It really used to get me down, it really used to play on my, you know, like, nerves, but now if I see, like, a, an angry comment or a nasty comment, I just, I just say thank you, thank you for your comment, or, like, if it's, if it's kind of, like, a funny one, like, you know, trying to make fun of me, I laugh about it, like, and, so, yeah, that's, that's basically, I just, I'm happy that there's a comment there, there's a view. So you just got to kind of ignore the hate, it is easier said than done, especially depending on your age. Like I'm now 24 and it, it kind of washes over me now, but I would understand that a younger person, a younger uh, person would actually, you know, really find that really bad. But that, that would be my first talk to try to ignore the hate and turn it into a positive, think positive and think it's a view, it's a comment. And yeah, so that's my first top tip. The second tip of the top five comments is be consistent. Now, I'm not really one to talk about this because I'm really not consistent. But I'm trying to be a bit more consistent now. So what I mean by that is you don't have to upload every day or upload every, you know, you can upload once you want when you're in, when you're in the mood and motivated. But try and be consistent in your niche. Now, what I mean by that is Gaming videos, I do gaming videos. For years, I would just upload in what I fancied. Now I'm going to kind of keep the channel uh, into Minecraft slash Skyrim and slash maybe some vlogs and story times. That's what I'm going to do from now on. So you just got to kind of find a niche. And like if you're doing a gaming video and you really like Fortnite, try and keep Fortnite going for a while and then maybe branch out to other things. Because at the end of the day, it's your channel. Your channel is yours. You are the owner, you are the creator, and you are the CEO. So you've got to be be unique. Be unique, but also be consistent with the niche that you're trying to do. So that's the second tip. Uh, now, my third tip is probably my favourite one that I need to do a lot more is uh, try to collaborate and do videos with friends. I find it so more genuine YouTube videos when people are in fun and they're with friends. It it shows a lot more, like I said, genuineness and it shows that you're actually having fun. And sometimes I've, I'll do a video with like a friend or wherever and like sometimes I'll just forget the camera's there. And we'll just forget that camera's there and I'll just have a laugh and then it turns out to be really funny like someone will do something that's really really funny and I think great that's a good clip and then I just think happy days so try and collaborate with friends if you don't have friends there are groups that you can join like Facebook groups and you could say hey do you want to play a game with me and you know put the camera on and see what happens it's all about trial and error but try and be um try and collaborate with friends and if they're YouTubers if they're YouTube friends or if they, you know, their friends that do YouTube, even better, because they understand you more. But I've collaborated with friend YouTubers, I've collaborated with just friends that don't do YouTube, but it, it's just fun. That's what I do think is it's, it's different, and it's fun, and I think it's more genuine of a video if you do that. So that is the third tip, or the fourth. Let me check. Uh, one, two, three... Oh, yes, four, four, uh, don't worry about four, sorry, my God, sorry, um, 
don't worry about having a schedule. Now, the first thing, be consistent. But if you don't upload, say you upload, you want to upload every week, but say you miss a couple of days out of the week, or you miss a day, don't stress about it. That was that was the big thing with me when I was doing YouTube at the start, was I was trying to sit, stick to a schedule, and I really give myself hell when I didn't stick to the schedule. Because, like, I thought, oh, well, people ain't going to watch me. And I understand that, and let people say, oh, get to a schedule, so your subscribers know. I understand that, and I fully get it, but sometimes you just don't want to do it. So, what I've kind of worked out, my tip here is, pre-record your videos. Pre-record. And then you can just schedule them to upload. It's a lot easier than, so if you just pick a day, and you just back to record a load of videos, then you'll be okay. And that you'll keep your schedule there but if you don't want to do that and you just want to you know keep a schedule that's fine but that would be my top tip is basically batch record your videos i should have probably said that at the start batch record your videos and then you can just schedule them as you wish through the youtube uploader so yeah and the final tip is the probably one of the most hardest of them all is just be yourself just be your genuine self don't put a a charade on people like to do YouTube personalities and you know some people like to you know be comedian on YouTube and try and you know try and get the most views. I just think you just need to be yourself. If you're authentic and yourself then you will very much go very far on YouTube and start gaining a lot more subs. Just like Mr Beast did, just like Syndicate and all the big huge YouTubers. So just be yourself. That is it. Thank you so much for watching, and until our next video, peace off.